guys welcome back to my channel so today i have a small dollarama haul it's mainly like household stuff um with like maybe one or two crafty items so um if you're not into that i totally get it i will see you guys in another video but if you are definitely stay tuned so firstly here guys um i was lucky enough to come across these two um pyrex like they're the conta glass containers um i love this size for like lunches at work not that i'm at work yet but um when i go back and gotta you know what i hate to say it but i definitely have had people mistake my tupperware before because we all have very similar tupperware you know like the, the classic red top lid so i'm so happy to find this in pink and i'm actually going to use my cricut to do some vinyl on this um so hopefully it'll be like don't take Callie's Tupperware home, you guys. <laughs> yeah. Um, so, so cute. And I love that it is Disney. I am on the hunt for that mug. Um, kind of like soup-ish container. Ugh, and it's Minnie Mouse. And I've been obsessed with Minnie Mouse because um, baby girl's first birthday theme in January is going to be Minnie Mouse. So I've started like ordering like balloon arches and crazy fun stuff. And I'm very, very excited for that. Whether or not she's going to have a COVID birthday or not, it's going to be spectacular. <laughs> so yes, there is that. Um, and then on the Disney trend. So you guys, I know everyone and their grandmother has been hauling all these Disney you know, um, kitchenware and stuff, but this, I wish they had them in the bigger, um, like full size, mid size, but that's okay. This is the mini and sorry, the Pyrex were five bucks each, which I think is a steal of a deal. Um, cause they are very, if they're like they're anything like the original, they're very durable. Mine is going on 10 years and it's like great condition still. So yeah, I had to get these, even though I don't need any more oven mitts but these are just so cute and like they're so nice and just the quality you guys so for five bucks like oh i i love the pink so that's for me i don't think my husband will use them and then um maybe i had more a little bit more crafty goodies than i thought okay this pad i i was watching tina kazarian's haul and she did haul um a glitter one as well i guess it's called like smarts and crafts and it this is the holographic paper pad there are 80 sheets and it's 9 by 12. um now originally i thought maybe it was going to be paperware and i was like yeah, i might pass on that but it's not bad like you can certainly die cut and use these for layering like um i have so many web dyes and stuff for halloween so i love this holographic paper I'm not trying to blind you but there is like such a great variety here and you know to buy even four sheets that's usually like a dollar fifty it's so much cheaper and these i believe are 475 there, no there's no price but i think that's what i paid this was like the last pad at one store and then i went to another store and they were like fully stocked i was like ah <laughs> so you know keep your eyes out if you're looking and this was not in the crafty section of my store this was in the stationary section and i almost missed it so just yeah keep your eyes out um these here are not new whatsoever but i don't think i've ever come across this particular purple it's kind of like um a darker iridescent purple and i really want to use these um, to make like cut flowers on cards, like like clusters of them. I kind of have something in mind, maybe something watercolor-ish. I don't know, but I just, I have so many of these in other colors, like the lime green, um, kind of that the magenta pink, the blue, but this color, so it had to come home with me. I was only $1.25. And then these stickers were new to me. I mean, maybe they're around last year, but um, they weren't even put out. I had to grab them from the package, like the bulk packaging and take them out, but they're only $1.25. And um, it's like fall themed and it's just like leaves and stuff. So I was just thinking like MDC ATCs, like that would be so cute. And then like, look at this one here with the fox and the, what is, I don't know, is that a hedgehog? porcupine i don't know and then like the corn oh my gosh like i'm sure these are more along the lines of thanksgiving theme but um yeah they're really cute and they're just they're a little puffy so there are those yeah oh here's another set i picked up and then 
these are not very, these are kind of boring, but um, okay, so for the holidays, in the last few years, I've been a wine gal and not drinking wine myself, but to give out as gifts. So um, my sister is a big wine drinker. <laughs> okay, that made, that didn't come out right. <laughs> I guess wine enthusiast. Um, so she she's like, she knows her wines, like her whatever, Merlot, Rosé, whatever, you name it, she knows her wines. I do not. I'm very like, don't ask me anything about wine. All I know is like, red and white and yeah that's that <laughs> so anyhow um usually i will pay a dollar 25 for one of these um i don't know i don't know what are these called wine and sp spritz bags or whatever but i saw two for a like a dollar 50 what is that like 75 cents each don't ask me to do math right now but i just thought this was a steal of a deal and this could be for multiple occasions, birthday, celebration, whatever. So I just like picked up several sets. Um, there were a lot more. There's like a rose and black, a rose gold and black. Um, but yeah, to stock up for the holidays and like at a fraction of what, um, if you want a Dollar Tree even, they're dollar fifty now. So yeah, steal of a deal. Um, so there was this print here and some of them are different. This print here, this is the gold and black, that was a silver and this is like a confetti. This set here, like I probably even would have paid two bucks if, oh yeah, so this one is actually, this one is two bucks. Now that I'm looking, I'm like, some of them are $1.25 or $1.50. Yeah, like even at a dollar a piece, it's still cheaper than a dollar fifty at Dollar Tree, or you know, you're saving a quarter. And then this set here, and this is the same as the first one, but in gold. I'm just curious how much this one. Yeah, this one's a dollar fifty. So that is awesome, and I'm like fully stocked for the holidays because we give wine to everyone. Like I'll usually go get. A case of wine and then that's what everyone gets easy peasy and everyone loves it and it just looks I'm talking about like family and friends not crafty friends at least hey guys okay this is like from another haul but I thought I'd just attach it to this um Dollarama haul uh, video so let's jump into this um I went there for golden sugar um this used to be a dollar now it's up to a dollar and a quarter um, this is a Facebook group made me buy it <laughs> enabled video. So, um, my, the, the group that I'm in, someone had shared this and it's like a great sensory toy. It's like a pop twist connect for kids. Ooh, it's three and older. So I picked up, um, two of those for my son. They're four bucks a piece. Since these pom-poms are randomly here, I'll share with you guys. Um, these were $1.50. I didn't have any green ones. So I thought that'd be great for some crafting. Or I've been throwing them in like um, as a mix with like shred and stuff. And it looks so cute. Um, this little puzzle here, it's a butterfly one. I've hauled these in the past. It looks like they are coming back with more of them. They are $2.50. Um, someone had shared this kitchen shelf with metal legs. I thought I'd use this in my bathroom, I'm thinking. Um, four bucks. So it's pretty good still. <laughs> I feel like everything's five dollars now. Um, these wonder bars, I've never seen them in these mini packs. They were two bucks. So I'll put them in like a candy bowl or something. And then um these here someone had shared on the group are these puzzles, the wooden puzzles. They were five dollars each. And so I got this one here with the like butterfly birds kind of insect theme. This uh, transportation vehicle one or vehicle I guess like rocket ship and plane and then I picked up the three I think there was one more I didn't pick up and then this is a sea theme I love that penguin it's so cute and so these are really large like my hand is very big and they're almost like the size of a hand each um yeah so turtle and oh so cute so I'm sure my son will get a kick out of those. And it's just so durable. Even if my daughter gets her hands on one of them and drools all over them, it's still pretty good. And then lastly, just a couple of these vitamin waters. 
um, a thing of apple juice for my son. And then I've been really enjoying like watered down, of course, because these are quite sweet, these aloe vera drinks. Um, in fact, I water down all of these drinks. So yeah, just thought I'd add this little snidbit to, <laughs> snidbit to my um. Lastly, oh. you guys, okay, so All Things Missy shared this bag and um, they had so many other prints. Like, they had, like, a leopard or animal. I don't know. What is it called? Leopard cheetah print. And then they had, like, a yellow, bright yellow one. Um, that's his, It was, like, a bee and then it said kind. So, be kind. Um, oh, I wish I had taken a picture. But, I was, of course, as a mom, I'm always in a rush. But this mama bag spoke to me. Um, there were a lot of colors and everything. But I found I would get the most use out of this, especially as a summer tote. It is so great, and I just love that it says mama, because I am a mama. And it was five bucks, and I know you're thinking like, oh, that's a little on the steeper end, but it's so durable. It's definitely well worth the five dollars. Um, on the inside here, you guys, I'm gonna try to show you as best I can. There is my dog's dreaming, so he's having those dreaming little barks. There's like three slots in here, one zippered slot, which is perfect for like a wallet or a phone credit cards or whatever and then on the side because i have a baby perfect for bottles or what have you like just perfect for hand wipes kleenex whatever and so that's why i'm like this is the perfect beach bag and it's like definitely a canvas um on the inside you can definitely wipe it down but yeah if you can get your hands on one of these bags i i don't know if they're gonna be around but I, like they've just been wiped out the store that i went to um they had several look like they just restocked but um i followed this group like a provincial um from like western canada for dollaramas and they're all like we can't find them and so yeah i was so happy when i saw them I'm like okay let me feel them so yeah, I love that. And I love watching Dollarama hauls prior to going to Dollarama because then I'm like, I know what to shop for, um, what's new, what is it worth it to go, like, you know, based on like what people are hauling and stuff. So it's it's great, especially as a busy mom. I can't just like drop of a hat. I'm going to go to Dollarama. I wish it was like that. But that means either A, I'm hauling my daughter out, which is a no-go for me. Like, I do not like to just bring her out with me um for nilly willy reasons like i actually will only take her out if like it's a doctor's appointment or something um you know urgent or i have to take her because i it's it's cold and flu season right now and no and on that note i literally uh canadian day thanksgiving on the friday um, I guess this is kind of like a haul slash chit chat slash life update which i'll add that in the title um I got my flu shot, my annual flu shot, and I decided to get the fourth booster. Like, uh, I don't know what I was thinking. So I felt like death for about 12 hours, like sick, like couldn't move. Like it was, and I felt so bad for my husband. Although that is why we did plan on me getting it on Friday and he's actually getting it this following Friday so we could, you know, tag team and help each other out. But it was, yeah, like I just started moving after. I wasn't as stiff anymore. I just felt so stiff. Um, and that was all better. And then um, my sister's kids uh, were not well. So then we had to cancel hosting at her place. And then I ended up hosting at my place last minute. But I'm just so glad I had the energy to do that because it was busy. It was crazy. Um, we bought a 23 pound fresh turkey and it was fabulous for like, it, I know if you guys are ever in a rut last minute, pay the extra money, get a fresh turkey. It is unbelievably moist and like juicy and delicious. And I literally probably sent everyone home with like five pounds. And that's my cue, you guys. <laughs> All right. Thanks so much for watching everyone. Till next time. Take care. Bye.